Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode on the Glenlatan series. Uh, as I'm sure you remember last time we started the bailing contract and uh, we didn't manage to finish it, actually we managed to cut the grass to thread it and we still have to row it up, bail it and uh, transport the bales to the cell point and of course hope that we can keep some of the bales. I already started the rowing and uh, I'm going to time lapse this and in the end I'll jump cut the road uh, the trip back to the to the store and uh, bringing back, back the the baler so I'll see you back here uh, when we start bailing Living life every day let it die not okay all I want and I pray all I need are some better day fuck me I'm looking in the mirror so foggy but I've never seen clearer I don't really think anyone can save me And honestly I'm not really sure I want saving I like to be my own worst enemy There's no risk if you don't try at anything So I'ma just get by in everything See you in the next life, have to be a better me I don't think that my head's on straight Gotta flip it and grip it and go and get an x-ray What's wrong with me? I just feel way Pushing on my chest and it squeeze till I suffocate Better change my mindset, meditate It's pretty cool that I'm alive and have better days I could walk, see, here, I should celebrate Think I could change my mind, maybe elevate Living life, every day Late at night, not okay All I want, and I pray All I need, are some better days Yeah All I need, are some better days Cause all I want, and I pray I believe Kinda stuck between a rock and a hard place Do I work hard or live at my pace? You're only young once, yeah that's all great But I also want a future where I'm okay Living life is doing lots of cocaine Wait no, it's living with no shame Wait no, it's sleeping in on Sundays I guess it's different for each of us and that's okay Well I just wanna be happy How to get there, hmm, glad that you asked me I think it's different for everyone Some of us need work, others need fun Some of us need purpose to overcome But try to do what you love when it's said and done Cause there's so many differences in each of us Trust your gut, it can show you what you want Living life, every day, late at night Not okay, all I want, and I pray All I need are some better days Yeah, all I need are some better days Cause all I want, and I pray I believe in the better days Living life, every day not okay, all I want, and I pray, all I need are some better days, yeah, all I need are some better days, cause all I want, and I pray, I believe in the better days. The raking is almost done, uh, probably in a time lapse this will be around 2.5-3 minutes, but in real life I think for me it's been more than 10. Uh, after this I'll need to go to the shop to get the baler, but uh, I'm thinking of jump cutting that uh, trip as I said earlier, you saw me in the last episode coming from the, from the shop here. So you don't want me, you don't want to see me go back and forth and waste a lot of time on this. So I'll just leave the rig here and uh, go to the shop, get the baler and I'll see you back here in a couple of seconds with the baler and start uh, baling the hay. Okay everyone, we are almost back with the baler to the, fi to the field and for this contract we have a big square baler and I've set it to do the biggest possible uh, hay bales so that we have less, to less bales to move. Uh, I'll get cracking with this, uh, I think in a time lapse this should be probably, I don't know, a two minute job. And uh, I will see you back here uh, in a couple of minutes with the bale trailer to start moving the bales.
Let's go. Yo. I'm like an addict, do I gotta have it? I ain't even playing, got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta grab it. Fuse like a magnet, lose, won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket. I ain't playing, got a weird mind. If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine. If the shit tastes sour, you should taste mine. I'ma stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. Big picture, I'm a straight killer. Rice in the song to the highest bidder. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back better than last. Yeah, it's a new me, never gonna look back. Never gonna look back. Cause damn, I was built to last. You move slow when I move fast. And that's facts. Only I can make a change. Slowly take a step today. I will never be the same. Cause that's what it takes. Okay everyone, so now we are back with the auto stacker, but before we start collecting those bales, uh, I want to take a look at the information screen and see how many bales we produced, uh, 24 on this session, so on this field, and why I did that, uh, because uh, I have a strategy when it comes to doing bailing contracts, especially when I want to keep some of the remaining bales that the contract will let us keep. I want to keep as many as possible and to, in order to do that I always check how many bales we produced of the particular field uh, we are doing and try to estimate if we can deliver a full load or we need to deliver a partial load and uh, see if that completes the contract. In this particular case we have 24 bales produced so we should be able without any problems to deliver a full load. I think this baler should be able to take 14 bales and uh, after we deliver those 14 bales we have 10 bales left on the field we see how much of the contract has been done because we will receive a percentage in the top right corner of our screen and then we can estimate how many more bales we need to take to the sell point to complete the contract and the rest of course we can uh, we can keep so we have 10 bales already on the trailer, let's load 4 more. I'll keep getting those ones from the bottom side of the 
of the field so it will be easier to get the other ones uh, when we come back and then we'll go to the sell point I think we need to take the bales to the sales export which is uh, just down from the field I mean uh, where there's the biogas plant and on the other side of the road should be the sell point where we have to take the bales so let's get over there and see uh, how much of the contract we do if we deliver these 14 bales I think from past experiences should be around uh, 70 to 80 percent of the contract complete with, uh, with these 14 bales but uh, from map to map you never know I mean I've played on some maps in which I delivered all the bales that I got from the field and the contract didn't complete I don't think it's the case for this one because I already did uh, I think a silage contract a few episodes ago and uh, it went without any problems but you never know so let's go and see and after we finish this contract the remaining bales I'm going to take them back to the farm and uh, feed them to the sheep I have a few hay bales in storage for the cows for the total mixed ratio so we should be okay if we feed them to the to the ship or at least we put them in the uh, feed trough for the ship and they will consume it uh, over time I think the capacity of the trough is big enough to take them let's see how much of the contract we do 87% of the contract with 14 bales so I think if we bring over two more bales should be enough to complete the contract so let's go and get two more bales from the field get them back here and uh, see if I'm right and the two bales will complete the contract otherwise we will just go and get another one it's not a problem I'll just uh, jump cut me going to get two bales and I'll see you back at the cell point we are back at the cell point we got the two bales as I said let's see if uh, they will be enough to complete the, the contract I really hope so because I don't want to go back to get uh, one more yes they did we have the contract complete on field 7 on the top right corner of the screen now I'll just go to the field collect the other bales that we have there and I'll see you back at the farm in a couple of seconds and we'll get to feed the sheep with them we are back at the farm and let's go take these bales as I said and feed them to the sheep let's hope uh, this trailer will be able to get under the building over here to be able to place the the bales in the unloading point let's put them here yes the pen is taking them I was afraid that uh, I was too far away but no it's it's okay now I can jump into the contract menu page and uh, complete the contract and we get 12,300 we have a deduction because uh, we list the farmer's equipment uh, and now since we have rain in the forecast and it's almost 3.30 p.m. let's uh, move to July I don't know if in July we will our I think barley we have barley in the in our arable field as I remember uh, I don't think the barley will be ready, but let's check. Yeah, we have barley. No, it's not ready to harvest, so it will be ready to harvest in August. Our grass shows is ready to harvest, but let's go and check because I don't think it's fully grown. 
No, it's not. See, it shows as ready to harvest, and it, if you look at it, it's still very green. It's not the, uh, I don't know, faded green like the meadow grass. So, even though it's ready to harvest, harvest, and we can harvest it right now, if we let it grow another month, it will improve the yield significantly. So, we'll let uh, the grass grow until July and uh, until August. And August will be a very busy month because we will have the barley harvest, we will have the grass cutting. But, yeah, okay. We have 10 liters of wool, so I'm very happy because our sheep started producing wool. Uh, they have food, they have almost 100,000 liters of food, so it's okay. Our cows didn't start producing milk yet. We have slurry, 10,000 liters of slurry, so we can maybe use it to uh, fertilize our arable field, but we need a slurry spreader and we don't have the money for that. Uh, regarding the feed, we need to put silage in here. They have... how many... how, how much totally mixed ratio? It doesn't say. We have 125,000 liters, so I'm not putting silage yet. Let... Uh, they have food, for now, at least. So today we cannot really do anything let's check on the on the contracts maybe we can do a contract but i don't want to do a bailing contract again even though we have this that uh, need to make silage and it's a big field we get a lot of money for it but i don't want to do another one we have harvesting oats on field 60 and field 62 where are those two fields Field 60 and Field 62. Uh, I'm sure they should be around here. So. There. 62 and 60. Uh, so yeah, maybe we can accept one of those contracts. But uh, yeah, we will accept Field 62, but we will also borrow equipment because our harvester is very small and it will take forever to to harvest that that field with with our uh, equipment so let's get in this harvester put the header on the header trailer and uh, go to the go to the field because we didn't uh, uh, go to that side of the map very often I will time lapse this I'll time lapse harvesting the the oats on, on that field and uh, I will see you maybe when the first load of oats will be ready to be shipped going to move again the header because I didn't place it correctly and uh, as you saw I cannot uh, turn the harvester around so I'll take it again and put it on the correct side and put it a little bit towards the back so I will see you when a part of the field will be ready Thank you.
Okay guys, so I said that I will be back when we have the first load, so we are almost full and uh, I'm going to go deliver this to the to the indicated cell point, I think it's the grain mill if I remember correctly, uh, and let the worker continue with the, with the harvest and uh, then come back probably on load or at if it's not ready to unload, finish harvesting the field, deliver the rest we have and uh, I think this will be finishing this contract will be it for this episode. Uh, regarding the oats we are getting from the field, I'm not going to keep anything. I know the best price for oats it's not in July, in July probably is the worst price that we can get for oats but it's not our field we when we do contracts I don't want to keep any of the crops from the from the harvest in the silo because it will be probably 1000 2000 liters of max from a field like this of oats that we need to keep in storage and sell when the price is right and we will not make let's say a lot of money for it probably will make two three four five hundred dollars max euros not dollars sorry uh, and that's why i'm not keeping any of the of the crop it, with grass it's something else grass and silage um, not grass hay actually hay and silage we need for uh, feeding the sheep and the cow so that's why I decided to keep the bales when we did the baling contracts and if we will do more baling contracts I will do the same thing, I will keep the bales but uh, when we do harvesting contracts I'm not going to keep any of the of the crop. This tractor is really struggling and this is not a big trailer, I mean this is a 19,000 trailer when it's full and it's not full, we have 18,000 liters in it and it's really struggling up the hill and this is a class iron so it should be I think almost 200 horsepower tractor so yeah it really it really struggles uh, so yeah that's with the with the crop from the harvest we are not going to to keep any of it of the contract uh, and probably after we finish the, this contract we will end this episode but in the next episode we will probably do another contract we'll see if it will be harvesting or something else I don't want to keep doing baling contracts because we will do a lot of bale work on our own farm and uh, I don't want to make this uh, a baling only series uh, we'll see what pops up I mean if we get a harvest contract will be a harvest contract because it's uh, I missed the entrance to the cell point and crashed in the wall typically sounds exactly like me so we need to go this way 
and this is where we are going to tip the oats the contract uh, I think is 70% done so the worker is doing great with the harvest and sh until we get back uh, he should be almost ready almost finished with the harvesting of the oats so I will put this again in a time lapse so we can speed it up and uh, I will see you back here at the cell point when uh, the harvest will be done. We are almost back with the last load of holes. Let's hope this time we, are, we will not crash in the wall. Uh, I think we made it. So let's tip this in and see how much can we make on top of the of the contract. I hope we make something on top of the contract. I'm not sure that we will. Ah, so we made almost 2000 euros. It's not bad. It's not good either, but it's not bad. Let's also collect on the contract another 3000 added to the bank. So we are at 15,000 right now, which is not bad. We will end here this uh, episode. Next time we will probably do a contract in the beginning and then move to August and start working on our, on our fields. I hope you still enjoy this series. If you do, please give us a, a like. If you want to watch more of my videos, you can subscribe to the channel. And in the end, see you next time. Thanks for watching.